Now, in years gone by, Indian music has influenced some of the biggest names in the Western music industry, and now it's shaping a bigger part of the Australian music scene. More young Indians are taking up traditional music to keep their culture alive, while Australian students too are being caught, taught Indian music techniques. Here's reporter Jessica Longbottom. I'm at Melbourne Polytechnic, where behind me the students are in the full throes of an Indian music lesson. Now, they're just general Bachelor of Music students, but the teachers here say it's so important for music students to have a grounding in world music, and especially Indian music, because of the special techniques that are required and the thinking that has to occur outside the box as well, which they can then bring back to their general music practice. For me, I'm very passionate about Indian music and um, it's got a legacy of almost 2,000 years has evolved and it's very complicated, very complex and it's such a rich tapestry of music which I think I have to pass on to the rest of the world. But I guess it is a little bit very, um, what I can say, very challenging kind of an art form. It's not like... A, it's not quick, and for them it's like relearning from the beginning. In the standard South Indian this system, there's 72 scales, whereas in the European there's only about 24. So there's a lot more attention to melodic variety, and also because of that there's a lot more attention to rhythmic variety as well. It's like learning two languages. When you study a second language, you learn all about grammar, and you start to see your first language in a totally different light. I really enjoy it. It's very relaxing. It's also very challenging. Just gives me an opportunity to think outside the box and see things from a different culture, a different perspective. We believe some, uh, that music has to be in your genes, if you have to have that, um, what we call jnanam in Indian words. In fact, the veena that I'm holding is my grandmother's. Her name's Lakshmi Bai, it's almost 100 years old. She used to play Veena and then it was my mother, Mangala Mutha Swami, they are all music, great, what we call Vainikas, who play on the Veena. And I think music is such a good tool just to relax and just be in harmony with the world. Now you see all the strife in the world, I think it's because we are not satisfied with ourselves in the first place. Um, we are not happy. So what Indian music teaches is to relax, think, accept what you are and strive to become better. I think it is a great skill and I'm so, I feel so blessed that I have something that I can offer to the world.